Okay, welcome back. This is Mr. Hassan's Mass Channel, and I'm now answering question number four from the May June 2020 um, <coughs> Cambridge International Exam. This is from the paper 2 1, the extended version of the variant 1 for this paper from the 0580 syllabus. This is a question on probability. So the bag contains blue, red, yellow, and green balls only. A ball is taken from the bag at random. The table shows some information about the probabilities complete the table. Now what we should know is that the sum of all the probabilities must always equal 1. Okay, so simply you need to take all of these values, you need to add them together and subtract them from 1. Okay, so you can just put this in your calculator if you wish, no problem, 1 minus and then you take away the sum of all the other numbers 0 0.15 plus 0 0.2 plus 0 0.43 have a quick check on your calculator that you didn't um, type anything incorrectly which is quite a common thing to do and that will give you your answer which is 11 over 50 um, it's better to write it in the same format that they gave it so 11 over 50 which is 0 0.22 okay so this is going to be 0 0.22 if they gave this in decimals you should also give it in decimals as well instead of writing 11 over 50 then part b says abdul abdul Okay, takes a ball at random. I'm going to change this to Abdullah. That's much more appropriate. Abdullah, Abdul Rahman. Abdul just means slave. This is slave of Allah. That's much better. Okay, so Abdul. Abdullah takes a ball at random and replaces it in the bag. He does this 200 times. Find how many times he expects to take a red ball. Okay, so um, this is called theoretical probability these are based on theoretical probability now if you do the actual experiment you're not going to always get exactly the same as the experiment as the theoretical probability you've got experimental probability but what you would expect is you would roughly have you know the same as the experimental probability so um sorry as the theoretical probability so if you want to kind of uh, find how many times you would expect that you would get a red ball you take your 200 and you multiply it by the 0 0.2 and that will give you the number of times you would expect to get the red ball you might not get it exactly that amount, that amount of times but it might be close to it the more times you do it the more times you pick the closer you will get to the theoretical probability all right so let's just take this 0 0.2 and multiply it by 200 and that's going to give you 40 times, of course. That's 40 times, all right, you will expect to take a red ball. That's the expected probability if the probability of picking a red is 0 0.2. Okay, so there's the end of question four, which is going to be in the playlist for this paper and also for the playlist for probability. You can subscribe to my channel by clicking on this link over there. Thank you for watching and see you soon.